An NKVA plan is drawn with three lines. The wall cabinets have a solid line, the base cabinets have a dashed line, and there's a third line for the countertop overhang. To draft it, the walls have three stringers, one for the chunk of cabinets and the openings, the other to show the openings of fixtures and appliances, and the third to show the overall dimension, and the stringers are drawn half an inch apart. The first chunk of cabinets, and then the opening, for the window, and then the second chunk of cabinets. Next, we'll draw the center line of the sink and dishwasher. Then we'll draw the overall stringer. To do this wall, we'll also draw three stringers, all half an inch apart. And first we draw that first chunk of cabinets and the opening between the chunks and then that last chunk of cabinets. And then the second stringer will be dimensioned to the center of the stove and the third will be the overall. You don't dimension the individual cabinets because they have codes like W2012, that means it's a wall cabinet 20 inches wide and 12 inches tall. The base cabinet only has the width because it's understood that it's 34 and a half inches tall. Next, you'll put in the dimensions in inches, and they are unidirectional, meaning they all read straight up. You might want to put CL on top of the center lines, too. Then measure and place dimension notes on the rest of the stringers. So. This is what an NKBA dimensioned plan looks like.